What is up guys, it's Matt from School Busters and today we're doing the endurance best setup in my opinion. That's how I won by 30 seconds on both of these races. I think I won a bit more with the endurance race though, so, uh, the prototype endurance race. But yeah, I'm going to show you the best setup that I chose and um, if you're going to go check out any of the GTA GT walkthrough series Go have a look at that in the uh, playlist and uh, other videos. It's all linked all over in the i cards and the annotations at the end. And um, let's move on. Right, guys, we're on prototype endurance series race one. Have you noticed that I've got? I've, I've already won it. It took me a few goals, but there again. So I'm going to enter the car settings. What you want to do is the best car setup. You want to turn it up to level 3, I know I got a Fission GT, because I got it awarded to me, I didn't buy it. Uh, this is my car, but you could do the same similar settings with other cars. So basically, power up to level 3, put the ratio high as you can, put the weight reduction low as you can. Uh, just because in the bottom, starts breaking, corner, uh, stability. I can't say that right, but... You want to always on traction control too, unless you're good with one and zero. Depends how good you are. I'm suited to number two because I like to get the power very early. Uh, you want to go on racing hard. Don't change your tyres because I changed my tyres to racing medium on the Porsche Cup and I uh, spun six times in the lap and lost first position. So ignore all these. You want to come down to the transmission. And you basically want to pull it to 10.0 as best you can. Don't pull it all the way because you slow your car down with uh, acceleration. Um, pull it to 217 because you don't need 249 speed on a straight. Because it's just. You don't need it. For power and lean with fuel map and fuel mileage, you want to turn it all the way up to 6 and eke out the fuel until like lap 11 and then you'd be like if you do 147s, 146s every lap you'd be like 4th or 5th catching everyone up flying past everyone so that's the prototype in German series race 1 next I'll be doing the Porsche Cup race 1 right guys we're in the Porsche Cup race 1 uh, I should tell I've already won it if you want to go check out any of the videos, uh, it'll be in the iCards. So what I used was 150 power percent uh, power ratio. Level 5, level 5, 87 weight reduction. Uh, I think some free because this car likes to whip out because it's a rear wheel drive. As it says rear rear. Um, yeah, so I had it on hard at the start of the race and then changed it to medium because I thought, oh, I'm in the lead here, get a bit of grip. But now it turns out the uh, life went straight away, went out the fucking window. <laughs> so I spun it like six times on the lap, lost lead by one lap, but I got it back straight away. Because I pitted and got hard, so keep on hard, unless you're good with finger. Like I said, keep it on 10.0 on max speed, so uh, I did 211. Um, I'm not the best with suspension, I don't know heights and rolls. But yeah, that's how I used to win the Porsche Cup race one with all these settings. I just changed the uh, max speed all set. Oh yeah, and the fuel map just put it to six again to eke out the fuel. You go like the fastest you could go. Uh, I don't know, I forgot the lap, tap, lap time. So you wanna do two minute eights, two minute nines for fastest lap. Um, just keep averaging them speeds and uh, yeah, speeds, times, averaging times and then yeah, yeah, it should be first by end of second pit stop, coming up to the first pit stop. But yeah, that's my setups for the endurance race. There you go. Right guys, that is the best setups that I choose because uh, that's how I won with a 30 seconds ahead on lap one for the prototype endurance series one and the Porsche Cup race one. 
So if you want to go check out any other videos, it's all linked in the i cards and the annotations at the end. And um, go check out the battlefield, any battlefield footage that we have. And uh, adios.